Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you guys Quinn's morning routine. We pretty much stick to the same routine during the week until we have to leave the house or we have something to do. So I just thought I'd share it with you guys. I hope you guys enjoy and if you do make sure you hit that thumbs up and subscribe button. So Quinn usually wakes up somewhere around 8 o'clock and so we just go in to greet her. Callie always comes with me and then we usually just have a little chat. I open up her curtains and then we have some morning snuggles. So the very first thing we do is head to the bathroom and brush her teeth. We always read a couple stories in the morning and so I just let her choose which one she wants to read. She always wants all of her Steffies to read stories with us, so that's usually the first thing she does is go into the basket and pick which Steffies she wants to sit on the couch with us. And then I usually am making myself a cup of coffee and I get her a cup of milk. We both just like to have a drink while we read. After we read stories, I head to the kitchen and start getting our breakfast ready. And so some days she wants to help with this, some days she pulls out her toys and wants to play. Um, it just kind of changes day to day. But on this day, she wanted to help me and so she knows to pull up her stool. And then I try to let her help with as many things as possible. So like using a butter knife to cut up the bananas and things like that. I just really like getting her in the kitchen at a young age. She was done helping at that point and so I just moved her stool out of the way. Um, and then we have got in a bit of a bad habit of having toast with jam in the mornings. Usually she has peanut butter but I can't eat peanut butter anymore, it's making me break out. So I've switched to jam and then when she realized how good jam is, she wanted that too. So I just put a little tiny bit on each of our toasts. And so this is something that people will probably disagree with, but I do let her watch a show while she eats her breakfast. She just watches one um, and I usually put it on like some sort of learning one, but she does tend to eat more of her breakfast. And then she also just loves that little morning time. She gets up and dances. And then it also gives me the time to run back into the kitchen and clean up everything from breakfast as well as I always unload the dishwasher. It just gets our day started off on the right track when everything can be picked up and ready to go. And then as I'm unloading the dishwasher, I always get her her water bottle. This kid drinks so much water, I fill this thing up about three times a day. Mm -hmm. 
It was garbage day on this day, and so she loves to look at the big trucks. Most of the guys are so awesome and wave back at her. And then she also takes breaks from eating to dance her butt off. Every time a song comes on on her show, she gets up and shakes it. And then after she's done her breakfast, we get dressed. And so then I do her hair, which her hair is at the most awkward stage right now. It's too long to leave down because it's just in her face all day. Um, but it's also too short to put in a ponytail, so I just try my best, but it usually falls out within an hour. So on this day, we were gonna be running out to run some errands, but we were just waiting for Bryce to get home from the gym. And so I just took out a few toys for her to play with while we waited. Um, this day she wanted to do a picnic for her stuffies. And so that's the toys that I pulled out. And then she decided that Callie needed some tea and cake as well. All the pets are so good with her and just let her do whatever to them. And then she just did a little bit of coloring, but Bryce was pretty much home at this point. So the video is going to end here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you hit that thumbs up and subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.